Soft Vellum products support WebRTC ultra low latency streaming. In this video, we'll show how to ingest WebRTC from Larix Broadcaster running on iPhone to Nimble Streamer Media Server and play it via SLDP low latency playback protocol. Nimble Streamer Media Server supports WebRTC for ingest via WHIP signaling. The received streams may have AVC, HEVC, VP8, and VP9 video with Opus Audio. For this video, we've already set up a Nimble instance. WebRTC's reception requires the transcoder installed and activated, along with the next options defined in the Nimble's config. First, Nimble must have a proper SSL setup defined by these values. The next options make WebRTC work using the WHIP protocol, and the last one helps the transcoder run smoothly if the resolution and codec changes occur in the incoming streams. Now let's go to live stream settings and create a new application for separate WebRTC settings. We name it WebRTC, obviously. Here we define basic plain text credentials for the demo purposes only. Use tokens to secure your streaming in a real life scenario. Uncheck all the protocols except the SLDP, as we need the low latency playback. Now when the settings are synced, we can take the connection settings for further ingest. We'll use Larix Grow format to export settings as a QR code. Click on the question mark to see publishing URLs. The only missing piece is the name of the stream. And then the code is correctly generated. Now, let's scan a QR code with a camera app. This will open Larix Broadcaster and will prompt to import settings. You can see it's been successful. To add WebRTC connection manually, tap on the plus sign in the right upper corner of the app. Next, Choose New WebRTC Connection, name it, place the publishing URL, select Audio and Video Mode, and add a token in the respective fields. Now we choose the imported connection for streaming. Now tap on the big red button to start streaming to Nimble Streamer Instance. Now let's check the resulting output SLDP stream. We go to the Live Streams page, and see the incoming WebRTC connection with AVC video and Opus Audio. Here's a quick way for checking streams, but to have low latency streaming, player settings have to be tuned. The developer's version of SLDP Player provides control for the player's parameters from the UI. In order to noticeably decrease the latency, the buffer has to be set to minimum. We set it as low as 500 milliseconds. We also remove all other parameters here. The stream is started, and you can witness the difference between the real clock, device captured time, and screen time. The glass to glass latency is about 1000 milliseconds. Take a look at this video description to find links to Larix Broadcaster and WebRTC setup instructions for Nimble WebRTC.